ile maafa ya kiwango ile ikiendelea tumewaambia watoke kwanza ndio tujue what really happened so this week i will be appointing a judicial commission of inquiry so that what happened in shakahola does not happen again in the republic of kenya jambo la pili nitafanya consultation na viongozi wetu wa dini katika taifa letu la Kenya tuwe na task force so that we can weed out the characters who want to abuse religion to run businesses and things that are anti religion in the republic of Kenya that we want to provide a framework agreed with our religious leaders a framework that will provide for self regulation so that church so that religion so that our spiritual leaders can have a mechanism where they can point out to government those who want to abuse religion for other purposes so tutaketi chini na wao tutakubaliana so that we can have a task force that is going to help us create a, frame, a framework where we can weed out the people who are abusing religion in our country so nataka niwashukuru sana eh, maskofu wetu kwa kutukaribisha hapa West Pokot eh, mujue we are your partners tutafanya kazi pamoja na nyinyi hawa viongozi wote wa West Pokot eh, mujue ya kwamba serikali ya Kenya tuko tayari kushirikiana na nyinyi katika kuhakikisha kwamba West Pokot inasonga mbele pamoja na taifa letu lote la Kenya tukungana kama ndugu moja nataka niwahakikishie vile vile ya kwamba kwa sababu tumemaliza uchaguzi na wa Kenya waliamua mepiga kura tukapata MCAs tukapata wabunge senators governors tukamaliza kura ya rais sasa tunataka tuungane wale wote tulio viongozi katika taifa letu la Kenya wa serikali na upande wa upinzani hakuna haja ya kuendelea na masindikizo ya mambo ya yale viongozi walipata ama walikosa sasa tuanze kupanga vile tutashughulikia mahitaji matakwa ya wananchi ya maendeleo na mipango yao ya kupeleka Kenya mbele Kenya is not just about leaders it is about 50 million Kenyans so we have we, we must be sensitive mahali tumefika ile mimi nataka niwahakikishie wa Kenya wote ni kwamba kila mkenya atapata nafasi yake ya kuchangia vile anavyopenda bidii yake kwa kujitolea kwake kusukuma biashara yake kazi yake kilimo biashara kazi ile ingine yote serikali ya Kenya itakuwa imara kuhakikisha ya kwamba mali na maisha ya kila mkenya inalindwa na serikali ya Kenya hiyo ni hakikisho i want to give to every citizen of the republic of kenya wale wanafikiria ya kwamba watatumia mambo ya siasa kuharibu uchumi wa kenya kuharibu biashara ya wa kenya kuharibu kazi ya wa kenya mimi nataka niwahakikishie they will be met with the full force of the law we will protect every citizen protect their business their interests and their jobs to make sure that we have a country that is founded on the firm foundation of the rule of law na tunaheshimu kila mtu tunaelewana jameni si mnasema tuendelee ama mnataka tuendelee na mambo ya siasa si tulimaliza siasa tarehe 9 mwezi wa 8 mwaka uliopita si wale wanataka tuongee siasa si iko siasa hapa mbele wajipange tutakutana mbele So watu wa West Pokot asanteni sana na wapenda sana